opponent is one who doesn't even know what they're doing. And that might be the case here on Vertigo. We'll see. They might have expected and have some prep, but look. Oh, no. Alish. Yeah. He gets himself three oboe. Oh, I thought maybe, you know, 3K for Alish, 3K for oboe. Can you believe it? Alish killed Fallen. Did he? Mm hmm Well, why has he done that longer? <laughs> I don't know. There must be some kind of punishment for for this. Yeah. What do you think Fallen should do to a leash? Mm. Before, but don't write like a fanfic live here. No, okay. <laughs> let chat do that. And let the mods make it a command. Embrace the fanfics. Except like... Yeah. Those ones. Yeah. yeah. Half of them. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all a bunch of freaks. We'll see if Liquid can get Freaky in the pistol, somehow claw back this to V2. I say claw back as if they're not favored by walking to the B site in a 2v1, but it's Daps. Come on, Daps. I want to cheer for oh. you. And I like this, redirection, misdirection, but I think they've gone to a bigger threat. You could have had Daps, instead you're going to get a little handful of Mihu. And, well, he takes a face full of damage. Drive-by from Naf and Daps into the 1v2. We are watching NA Counter-Strike cannibalize itself. Mm. Quite, a, quite an interesting mid-round, actually. I like the idea behind showing yourself on B, but just committing to going A. Yeah. Because if Mihu had flanked, then he's not there. And if he's on A, it's still a 2v1. Daps walks in, sees the guy in the back, knows the other's close. Daps, if only! If only he had that team kill. Sealed his own fate. Yeah. He knocked down like the crash test dummy in between him and the guy with the gun. Yes. We'll cue it to the next round. It was like when you stare at someone through the glass on Nuke, and you let them shoot first so that they do half the damage with the op. Yep. I hate when that happens. I also hate MP5s, but I like a leash, so I'm very torn in this situation. Yeah, I hear you. Man's got a pea shooter. We're playing Counter-Strike, not Airsoft. The attack is coming. They've established on the short shelf. I think they have Stewie just watching the flank in this position. Chilling and waiting, yes. Up close, almost. MP9 could have gotten something going. There are two players tagged up for Liquid, so maybe the Deagles can uh, piece something together. Fallen dodging that flash. It hits the face of Mihu. He gets wrecked by it. And then they alleviate all the pressure that did surround this bomb site. Rotate could still come over here from Cirque. Looks like Spellin's already just carving out an exit route. Wants to hang on to that Deagle armor. Smoke and flash. What do you think he'd be Spellin? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you got to you, you got to get that in because this, you know. What's the hardest word to spell that should be easy? Um. Ooh, that's a that's a very difficult question that I wasn't ready for. You let that ruminate. Spell ruminate. Ruminate. R U M E N A T E. Ruminate. R U M E. Is that what you said? Yes. I'll let Chat deal with this. Got him. Bring that game back, Valve. Let's do it. Great game. Thank you, production. That was very specific ask. And you guys delivered. As per. As per. We know the deal. I like how Liquid kind of are... I mean, it, it, a little bit... Kind of know what they're gonna do on their anti egos, but they're just they're just so effective at uh, how they're clearing everything else. Like I don't, not really many answers to stop them, and yeah, they've done a good job of it. All the kills come down on the ramp where the CTs are looking for all the engagements. It's a fight. I always spelled surprise with one R. Okay. In rise, that's it. Not not after the supper. That was like my big embarrassing thing that I always did and didn't realize it. I appreciate you. I would say just surprise. Yeah. Not surprise. Well, you're an idiot. And then to my smoke. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we got a B exec getting ready. They're going to go for the Molotov behind the wood. That enables this easy boost. Nobody over towards quad. Nobody towards the front box. It's just the headshot angle here from the AUG. Spelt A-U-G. 
E. Smoke goes down on the Molly. Daps gets wrecked, dude. That's the SMGs enabled. The tenacity, the speed, and the spelling oh! with the three kills on the AUG. Gets them all done. Nicely done. Considering Daps went down that quickly, this is an excellent... He deserves it, right? He deserves okay, it. Okay, yeah. We all do. Now, what I think we don't want to see, I, I, I want to see, I want to see EG be relentless on this ramp. Right? Okay. We know that this is the current best formula. It's what Liquid are prepared to take down. We know how good Elyse is at fighting these places. Yeah. But that there's a reason that people will fight him there because this is where the CTs are winning rounds, defending against bomb plants, having the most success. So I want to see EG either reaggress, attack it hard, or have multiple people ready on the ramp instead of just falling back because. You let him get too far, you lose control. There's nice re-aggression. Perfect timing with some cover on Mihu as well. Oh no, Bobo lets him die, but he gets the refrags on too. With the Galil goes in. One more coming. Yes! That's free from Naf. He goes nice. down. Nice. Obo with the big 3K in the gun round with the worst rifle. So. <laughs> I did try. It wasn't well, but. You're much more of a Squidward. That's not how I clap at all. Stop it right now. Bank accounts emptied out for Liquid. EG with a real chance at tying up this game three apiece, nice and early. And so far the heroics come in from Spellin and Ovo. You know, Ovo kind of quietly had a very rough map last night. And we didn't, we, you know, I don't want to harp on EG's potential exit from the event, so I didn't, I didn't want to throw him under the bus when he was already getting ran over. It, I think it's always good for him to do it in a map where they're playing a little bit better, yeah. where you can look back. Yes, now I can say, hey, Obo, what was that? Yeah. <laughs> and he's going to say, watch this. Yeah, watch this. Okay. Uh, Liquid, test the mid-control. They don't get EG away completely. It looks like Cirque's still staring down mid. So I don't think uh, this has too much of an effect. But the cool part about Vertigo is you can pretend to go A, pretend to go mid, but it doesn't matter. As long as you get the elbow here on A ramp, mm -hmm. you're still just as powerful, even if everyone else is there. So, um, at this point, it looks like EG are convinced, though, that is some kind of B attack. They'll be fine to try to retake, I think. They've held on to a fair bit of utility. Uh, but a retake, again, it's just, not as, it's just not as common anymore. It's not as fun. It's not as favorable for the CT side. You try to avoid it if you can. Naf encroaching closer. Oh, Yikes. ball and ready for the Daps peak. Oh, and down goes Obo. Not to mention Elyse able to hold the smoke. Mihu thought maybe he could just throw himself into the mix. Yeah, they tried to do the thing. They tried to be like disruptive while the plant was going down, but they, they just couldn't make any forward progress as soon as they decided to do it. The bomb was getting planted. Fallen had that perfect cover. I think there was also, I feel like there was a missing smoke, which made it a bit more awkward. Like, they might have pr wanted to try to flash through the smoke and all attack at once, but the right side site was wide open, and so maybe they didn't anticipate that, and they thought that, like, we were going to try to smoke both sides. I'm not sure, but could have been the idea. Bomb will explode. Two guns saved, at least, including an op here for Cirque. Quickly, YouTube, Owen Wilson skateboarding, and that's an excellent video. I'll need Enjoy. to see that, actually. Enjoy. Oh, Presente. The ultimate pop flash. There it is. Mid control instantly. All Very CTs quick. are dead. Damn, that is lickety split. Lick it like a mouse pad. Okay. Grim, dude, he's just got Spellin turned his back. Spellin's probably thinking, I've got to do as much damage as I can at the bottom of the ramp before they take this site from me. Probably didn't uh, expect that. But nobody came to him. Stampede across the site, yeah. Yeah, that was his, I mean, his best chance was try to take that fight at the bottom of the stairs, hope they don't just barrel across the site like they did, which I, I think that was pretty crazy how fast they went across, to be fair to Spellin, so. But yeah, usually in situations like that, if you're the CT stuck on the site, Dust2 B site is the best example, where if they split on you, like, it's very common to either push out of the door window or push tunnels, if you think you're doing, like, three or four players out mid. Kill the guy who's by himself or only has two, you know, yep. a teammate or two around him. Don't sit in the site because then you just get split, and that's where the T's are most comfortable. And then maybe you have a chance. So that's the idea he was going for, but very smart from Liquid to just slow it down. Make sure to crush that stair side together. That's what you sound like. 
<laughs> Cirque's got his up. I'm ready to see it, Cirque. Throw yourself down there. Get what you want. Do the damage. He actually hit Fallen. Hit him hard. And then Spell gives cover. This is perfect. Nice. I like it. Nobody out middle fast. It was presence down at the base of B. I'm very curious to kind of see what Stewie thought his play was because we were still on, on Cirque's sniper. Did he just walk through a smoke blind? He does that sometimes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure either. So, uh, luckily we have a great replay team, we'll find out. And in the meantime, we can focus on Obo, who's looking for another uh -oh. multi-kill alongside Mihu. That's two of the three CTs on this A site getting aggressive, and they get shut down with only one kill between them. But this could prime Daps. Oh, and Elyge? Oh. Nice. Daps in quick, down goes Elyge. Had very little health, so it was made easy. But it's still important to hang on to that man advantage. Naf fakes the sound cue just in case somebody would have heard it from the top of middle. And Grim reveals that there is still presence wow. here on A. Dapsy tries to re-aggress. Wow, he should have absolutely, you know, got out of there. Grim just set him up for that play. Yeah. He was expecting to at least get control, but he got the kill as well. And now the 2VX. Okay, so Grim and Naf now are very low. Yep. Half of Grim's HP burnt by the Molotov as but Cirque used it to reposition back here on the shelf. Spell needs to prime that Molly, like, as soon as he thinks the plan is going down, because that could be incredibly effective. Let's see if it comes out. No. no. He's always oh, slow on the ramp, sorry. Yeah, it's not here fast enough, but he does... Oh, I was gonna say, arrive quietly still. Grim, so ready for it. Grim looking like a killer these last couple of rounds, and it is Cirque on for the 1v2. So smoke on top of Bomb, over the box. Taps it within smoke, doesn't take any damage for that. Misses though as he flicks down on. Like figuring out, you know, whether they play that 2v2 like badly or not. But the only thing I can think is if Spellin was just slower there, then maybe the kill comes to him. And, oh wow, Grim. Well, shoot and you shall receive, and that is the deal on ARAM. This is going to happen sometimes. You got to be careful because I, I really think that it's the uh, the, the T side that it, it's, it's much easier to figure out exactly where they're going to be, like yep. in terms of reference points with that smoke down on the ramp. Spamming into the left, spamming onto the, the, the right by the ramp. That's why you got to play the A1S. No tracers. Another argument for that. No tracers. No overwatch here. What's that? Stewie. That's just... That's sweaty. God, that is such a nerdy angle. Mm, sweaty 2K. Tracer is a very popular Overwatch character, mm, Launder. That's why I didn't know what the game was. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. I'm just kidding. Funny guy. I'm just kidding. Gonna need a mercy heal for that burn. Alij left alone, and he is going to be surrounded by the CTs. Dies, but then, unfortunately for evil geniuses, yeah, there's nobody else there. No bomb, and no way to stop Liquid from planting on the opposite side of the map. So will EG be primed for another save? This would be like the third time they walk away with guns. A wise man once said, you can never save too much. He wasn't very good at CS, though. Yeah. He was just smart in general. Okay. This is Grim getting the best of Oboe. Oh my god! He, he just like he cal he calculated the trigonometry of the nade angle as it came through the smoke okay. and knew exactly how far it came from, knowing that Oboe would also slide to the left in that specific situation, triangulate his coordinates, and then launch a missile strike. Okay. Yeah. Another buy up for evil geniuses. I'm trying to piece together silver linings, uh, and and I feel like that's at least one. Cirque's on the off. Me who has an AK. We've seen Stewie disrespect this base B smoke. We've seen Elise try to play around this, regardless of whether he's on his own or not. And in this case, yet again, he is. How about another mid play? Is it Daps to receive the aggression? He is here alongside Cirque, tries to get aggressive, peeks out into Grim, who gets the better of the duel. And now we've got that man advantage back for Liquid. Oh. But it's taken away from them. Mihu going down, finding Elise. Okay. Check out the HP for Grim. That's low too. Yeah. This is the the hard part is like even if you get a kill like that you can't just flank on Vertigo that easily, so they will peel back, which means this is four to four. But there's also no aim ramp push, so the CTs are still spread. 
And now the entry's coming. Only one player in the site. The Ooh, trade comes yes. down. But they get info on Cirque. He misses the second shot. Cirque is low as well. Damn. God angle here. Smokes the first guy and then misses what you'd argue as the easier of the shots. Oh, Grim gap next to Orange. Mihu dying to fall in as he just comes crawling out from his cave in mid. And that's going to leave Cirque to walk away. That's the, tr the trouble right there is that, uh, yes, the CT's Ouch. got the last kill. And they also got a deep A ramp. But y we all know, like, even if you get the kill deep A ramp, that doesn't mean you can just walk over to the other side through spawn. It's not safe. It's so hard to clear all those angles. And there's so many ways you can die on the, on the way to the other side of the map. And you've got to walk, first yeah. of all, in case they're mid or whatever. So it's, uh, it's not as valuable, I guess, to get that refrag as it would be on some other maps because of the nature of Vertigo. Which meant that for Liquid, they knew someone was deep A ramp number one. They might even have info on two players there. Situation. We move on. Just got to keep on trucking. Good grenade damage. Yeah, they play that game again. At least that nade is just for Grim, but this time Oboe doesn't die. Oh, but taps Will. Man, they are bullying him in middle, but Mihu. Oh, he doesn't finish the kill. Obo is there to get a liege, and Grim with 3 HP. But it's all going the way of Liquid. I mean, they're already on fire, and they show no sign of cooling off whatsoever. That was brutal. No, they, they get the, you know, they lose the opening duel. They try to win one back, and it, it, I think it's the flash tactic for Mihu. It's not a ridiculous play. Like, people do that, but there's obviously players on both sides, and he can't even get the first kill, unfortunately. And... Uh, yeah, Cirque has a very interesting save on his hands. There's not a lot of good places to stand. It's one of the more common spots when you're not sure of where they can be. But we can we can see the bomb isn't even planted yet, so they're all getting in position to basically just pounce on him. Oh, first target. Come on, Cirque. Oh, uh, baited in. Cirque was regularly emptying his mag. But at the same time, he was almost never alone. And I think that that's what they expected. That behind the smoke, Grim was the one spamming. And he was also by himself. Or that it was a liege by himself. But there's been two players beside him waiting for those kinds of pushes. Not making any presence whatsoever. And while that smoke's still up, that's when they were at their strongest. And I think that uh, EG just learned that he's had some help the whole, whole time. Yes. Do you believe in the Oboe M4 raid boss? Yes. He's on the right side of the map. We'll see if Liquid are on the right side of history. Ooh, very deep. Okay. Molly over the short. The numbers are here. I mean, again, we're looking for we're looking for tidbits of success, right? Counter strike, round by round type deal. Let's see if EG can win this one. Two pistols ahead of Oboe's M4. Smoke's about to fade on a liege. Watch him spray all three. Watch him murder the masses. E's got the first two, but Oboe will survive with the 26 health at the very least. However, his entire team is dead around him and Grim with the double kill to close yeah. it. That's You're still able to call like a flash tactic here or a timing and execute that as well and just give your opponent too many things to juggle at once. And I think that's where you look really solid as a team, which I think Liquid have definitely looked a lot better in regards to, but... Um, that's when it's just the hardest to read as well. You had all those EG players just staring directly at that smoke, not expecting a flash, thinking, man, they're just working a ramp this whole time. They're probably partially ready for this, but not totally. We see the barrel. Oh, no, but then the second player peeks beyond the barrel. Oh, that's a great nade. Oof. Oh, man, they, they just take so much damage here. Yeah. Two out of three players, incredibly low HP. Thing is that we'll see once we switch sides as well, right? Like Team Liquid are. I think Fallen can see him. I'm pretty sure Fallen can see him on this angle, but doesn't notice. Ooh. Oh, nice! Nice shot. Team Liquid just a strong example of both A ramp success on the T and CT side. If you and your buddies are trying to replicate somebody on Vertigo, I'd say get the Liquid A setup in your back pocket. Come on, Dap. Ah, uh, pretend you never shot. Mm. Spellin's patience, Aug up close. He's gonna get Naf in the background. No Stewie's even closer. And look, the player cross by. Good trigger discipline, good positioning, no panic. 
you know, for somebody who is a, a last second stand-in, these are what we're looking for, right? He's looking to showcase his ability, his skill, and his value for anybody else who happens to be watching this match. The map is relatively T-sided as it, I just double check to see where we're at these days on Vertigo. It's still leaning, uh, leaning more towards the T. It's not drastically, but it's still towards the T. So at least EG have that to look forward to. CTs here, Grim. It's kind of sliding through all the utility. Fire's gonna tell him, but Obo can't get his gun out fast enough. Luckily, Mihu, good for both. He picks up the pieces that he absolutely needed. He'll leave with 12 health, but at least he dropped that bomb carrier. He knows Elise is relatively hot on his heels. And EG could bag a fourth. Definitely coming for it. Stewie makes some noise here on the B stairs. Daps occupied at mid. Two players over here. The, there's no help right now for uh, Mihu. They haven't been stacking correctly. But at the same time, of course, they've got numbers. Even though HP is not looking incredible. So, you know, you absolutely cannot write Liquid out. Especially when you get this control. This is where they want to be. They've got the nades to take over things. And we'll see if EG respond at all after thinking it's going to be a fake of some sort. Looks like the plant's going to come in from the short side. Well, look at the formation right now. It's so nice from uh, the approach from uh, Team Liquid. Uh oh, oh whoa, hot. As I say. Too hot. Fire spreads. Four seconds to spare. Off from Cert could stop the bomb, but Stewie uses that as his chance to take down the back line of evil geniuses. Now they're going to be stuck retaking from Elevator, all three. They've been very cautious of this, like, potential lurk in the mid. But it's all in from Liquid here on site. Ali shuts down the smoke push for the first time. It's Stewie to get the second. And now Daps able to clear one, but it's over on the back shelf that Naf resigned. And it's just them looking sharp in that regard. I would appreciate that mid round. Maybe another push through. We've seen Mihu just charge in and succeed on some of these hits. There it goes. Ah, oh, but he gets caught by Elise with so many players from Liquid down here, even with two of them blind. It's Elise who has the vision and the ability to stop him. Naf gonna move forward as Stewie also gets a kill on the B site. So we've got numbers thinning from evil geniuses on each half of the map. And Dab's pushing forward. Well, he could get caught by Stewie here in the corner. Oh, ho, ho, Daps wins his duel. Wow. Naf uses this chance to go from mid to B to CT. And we'll see if he catches anything. Cirque could have just gotten away with a decent bit of timing, but unfortunately that's going to cost Oboe his life. Really primes Liquid to come over towards this A site, and oh. Cirque can't flick into Naf fast enough. So Fallen moves in with conviction to plant this final bomb of Team Liquid's T side, and Daps has 11 health for the 1v4. I'm going to call it a 12-3 for Team Liquid. Basically two... Well, that's where they find themselves. So maybe we'd be spelling victory. V-I-C-T-O-R-Y. Victory. Massive dub. I had to climb to the 51st floor to see that massive dub, boss man. Mm. Enjoy it while you can. Enjoy what's left of this Vertigo map, because it might not be much. We'll see. Pistol could give EG some breathing room. Elise very quickly with the CZ. Five v five pistol retake. Fun stuff. USP to the face of Cirque. The automatic CZ gets the head of Obo. Mihu Holy. on the flank. One Glock shot. Two for Mihu. Daps goes down with one kill to his name. And Mihu, come on! So close. So damn close for a little bit of a chance on EG's side. Instead, it is Liquid. Ten round lead. A liege with three. The CZ. It's Eames. Yeah. And avoids that whole issue of having to go to the right side of the generator. I really love that. It was such a nice try, though, for Mihu. Shame that he couldn't get that one. So close. So incredibly close. Grim's MP9 on the solo B hold. Next closest teammates, Naf over on construction. So I feel like if I'm Grim, I just keep myself tucked. If they walk up, they walk up. 
He's gonna hear them getting closer. Got hit from both sides. That's officially a bad angle. Yep, good opening from Cirque. Nap peels two off. He got the headshot into Cirque. Very clean second kill, but Mihu very much trying to keep this game alive. Stewie rotates in, gets the better of Daps, and Elige, well, his flank just got shut down. Obo jumps up onto the wooden panel and Mihu. Holding one side obviously would have been would have been good for him, but still. They don't get the pistol, they get the second round, which is sometimes sweeter. But this is still going to be a meaty half to chew through. And it's got the tendons and bones and everything. The good stuff. Yeah. They're going to have to get through the marrow to get back to 13. What you got for us, Grim? Well, Dap's got something for you. Molly on his feet. Oh my god, he still gets Daps. Poor Daps. He throws the utility, flushes him into the open, and just gets Juan League in the teeth. But he can transform from IGL to coach. That's true. Just gotta switch out the hats. Fallen, Elige, each with a kill apiece. This is not how it's supposed to go. That last round was meant to give Evil Geniuses a chance. And the chance is still alive, but it's a slim one. 1v4 for Cirque, bomb in his possession. Pistol player is ready to push. Fallen doesn't have armor, Stu does. Second plant gets the push to come outwards, and oh, oh. it's so cool. Watch some James Brown interviews. They are a hell of a, a hell of a trip. Down memory lane. Pistols and one rifle. If Team Liquid can do it, then so can Evil Geniuses. That's what they've got to tell themselves to keep Liquid off of that golden 15. Flash beyond the ramp. Oh, oh, just on the way out. That's the Iverson. Why are you doing He was just on the way out. Oh, my God. Oh, and said, we talking about practice. Stewie, he pushes out beyond the smoke. Will be traded by Cirque, so the AK at least good for the one. Elise is like, give me a piece of that pie. Key lime. That's some waffle fries. <laughs> <laughs> Oboe's Deagle goes down empty handed. Daps is on the scoreboard. Come on. And Cirque used that chance to work his way into the site. This would be a two versus four. Now what? kills Elise. Grim has bomb control. With the Molly from a long time ago. This angle could be inter Whoa. Okay. Huh? Um I don't think I don't know if he knows something no somebody knows something that we don't know. Okay. Because there's something happening. Grim is safe. Okay, he is definitely safe, but can't really be a part of the retake for the for the moment. We'll start walking up now, making it seem like it's a big rotate out. But obviously circled heard that smoke, just grabbed the bomb instantly. And now we've got the ring around the rosy. And Grim already used the smoke, so we will try to go for a stick. Oh my god, nearly. That's perk. All right, a little walk contact B-site. Fallen solo scout. One scout, four digs. Make it three digs. That's clean. Grim goes down quick and easy. I love the super light executes like a very very you know low clearance grenades and one just come right at you use a little contact play involved with them it's a smoke a flash of molly and just see how creative you can get that's what you love to see they want to peek again liquid will hang back let the round come to get come to them if there's going to be any exits i think they've got all sides caution taped off For the moment. How many players are they gonna take with them? They're gonna take two players. Two? Yes. Two go down. Two go down. Oh! Wow. Yuck. And now we're gonna get the Elish peak. But he gets shut down. Nap extends a little too high in. I can't wait for after parties to come back so we yeah. can karaoke again longer. And you were sending me videos from after parties where I was like, yes, dancing and stuff like that. Just like being great. Can't wait. It's coming back soon. I wish all of your friends and fans could see you do Superman all the by Eminem 
It's the best karaoke I've ever seen at a They're CS event. Exclusive eyes only. Only players and talent have seen that. Oh, double sandbag stack. Oh, please, please check it. Miku gets two taps and oh. Zerk's like, what are you guys doing over here? <laughs> he gets the double. Get a room. Clears the threat. <laughs> and Naf walks away. He wasn't invited. He's got Grim to work alongside, but uh, we're gonna we're gonna chew through some pistol players, give Evil Geniuses their seventh round win, and then it'll be guns versus guns as EG trail at the half. Mac 10's good. I mean, Galil's insane. So yeah, Galil's better. Fair enough. Alige, this is aggressive. Wow, man. he's flying. He's got a one has aggression. He just took care of everything right there. The entire ramp cleaned up. All the nades go down. No one's here. Like, never seen more efficient routing. Love that, yeah. Good position from Fallen. They walk into him. Oh, nice. He takes two. He doesn't just op. Double headshots. He's not just an opper. Nope. He ops and he awes. Spellin walks in. If he doesn't check quad, he's a dead man walking. Meanwhile, Mihu looking for his one tap down on ramp. Spellin will get Grim, but again, it's the quad player that's really going to put an end to this, especially if Spellin's like, yeah, it's clear, come over. And Naf, you know Naf will take his time. Sure enough, Elyse gets into position. Daps, nice snap, but Elyse takes down his teammate and... Yeah, just unfortunate, but... See if EG can make a show of it. Another attempt down here, the ramp, but it looks like Elyse had a good spawn. Yeah, I'll go for the exact same play. Run it back. Routing better than uh, Toronto to Chicago. Face it. There's not much counterplay here for EG. They'll chill and wait. And you can see the, the difference here is Liquid are going to be a lot less friendly about contesting. Oh, oh wow. wow. What a lineup. I mean, he used a ruler for that one. That had nothing to do with seeing anybody. And the phase of the smoke on the left side. How's that going to go? Oh, uh, close. Almost on the money. Mihu's got a chance to bring it back from the 3v5 at the minute mark. Cancels out a liege. And we've got Daps on the slow lurk through mid. Daps is crawling underneath Grim. He gets spotted and Daps wins the duel. That's a big kill to pick up. Mihu, however, caught in Naf's trap. Obo struggling with the movement is caught by Fallen, and now poor Daps, 26 HP in the 1v3, 30 seconds on the clock, and their tournament life here at the Blast Fall groups on the line. An unideal situation for Evil Geniuses, with not only their coach as a player, but then a last-second stand-in, too. 